Waking up in this house with three people is so bizarre. We come in, and there's 16 of us, and now we've narrowed it down to three. I could just hear the crunch of the money. I could smell it. Knowing I'm in the final three, I'm really, really stoked. I'm the only girl left, and I think there's one person that doesn't really deserve to be here, and that would be VJ. He's very sneaky, very underhanded. He did everything he could to knock people down, to get his little edge, and I just think that sets a bad example for what models should be. I can't believe I have taken down all of these people single-handedly. That's an achievement. Erica, I love you, sweetie. You're a little too short. Never going to be high fashion. Mandy Lynn, you're the sweetest thing in the world. You're so civil and you're so cool and so sweet. Uh, it looks like you're going to do adult entertainment for a while, so props to you. Gaston, man, it has so much potential, bro. What the hell? Lisa, great. Great girl, Mary Alice. Last name is not Alice, it's Stevenson. I don't know what the fuck were you thinking. I never had a chance to talk to you. Whatever your name is, you're too damn orange. This is crazy. I kind of miss everyone. Daniel. <laughs> never fuck with the Russians. Slutty Rachel. I don't know what the hell you're planning on doing with your life, but I don't think it's going to be modeling, sweetheart. They should all come back so I could get rid of them again. <laughs> um. Stress is good. Angela. Angela, great. Right. Angela! And you, bro, you better pray to God and all these angels and all these armies. It is not a fucking photo shoot. Because if I'm right, you're both dead. It is my mission to take Vijay out. He's a slimy, snaky bastard and he needs to go. Yo, guys, Vijay, Angela, and Andre. Congratulations, you three have come so far, yet your biggest challenges still await you. So pack your bags, because you're about to take a little overnight road trip. Overnight road trip, yo. I got backseat. The madness begins. The last three. This is real. Let's bounce. Do it. We out of here. On our way to only Lord knows where. Where are we? Palm Springs, homie. What the hell is Palm Springs? Wow. Can we get any bigger houses? This is nice. We pull up to one of the coolest houses I've ever seen. Oh! We actually had gifts, and it was beautiful. Gift baskets of chocolates from around the world and champagne, and our photos from the Robert Erdman photo sheet were framed. Nice. Look at the robes. Wow. OK, let's read the note, guys. Congratulations, models. You are here because each of you is an embodiment of brains and beauty. Up until now, I haven't had a chance to get to know you on a personal level. That will change tonight. I'll see you shortly, Mary Alice. I'm really excited about Mary Alice joining us for dinner. I've really just wanted to sit down and pick her brain about the industry and advice on how to move forward. Mary Alice is going to join us for dinner to get to know us at a personal level. Nice. This is my chance to show her the sweetheart that I truly am. to hang out with you. I really see Mary Alice as a very caring person. She really is <laughs> cool, and she's really attractive. Well, obviously, this is the site of your next challenge. Really? Yes, it is, which is a photo shoot, but we're not going to talk about that photo shoot now. We're going to get to know each other. We're going to have dinner. Photoshoot. You guys can ask me whatever you want. I get to oh, ask you whatever shoot. I want. I knew it was a photo shoot. <laughs> and I just love it. I am the model, and they know it. Let's go over here, because this will be a little bit more cozy. So why did you want to be in this competition? Why do you want this title? I've struggled my whole life. I grew up in a house with six kids. Wow. 
and the oldest of six. Together. So that explains everything with your kind of with your personality, Angela. Because you, you definitely seem like you always want to be in control. So you were always taking care of your brothers and sisters. Always. I have a brother who's ten, and I helped raise him. My strength comes from a lot of the obstacles and the adversity that I've had to face growing up. So, Andre, tell me about you. How old were you when you arrived in the U.S.? I must have been some 18, 17. Wow. So what did all your friends think of you doing this? They, they said, whatever you do, before you open your mouth, think, please. So they told you exactly what Robert Erdman told you and exactly what I've been telling you the whole competition. What I want to prove to Mary Alice tonight. I know that I don't know everything about this industry, but I know that she is that woman to teach me, and I'm willing to learn everything. Is this really gonna mean a lot to you to win this? Yeah, just for so them. So your parents struggled? My, I, well, I was raised with my mother and my two sisters. Wow, I'm so where's youngest. your dad? He's in Texas, he was everywhere. He was, uh, he was a musician, don't marry a musician. My mother and my father divorced at, I think I was one and a half, maybe two, so I don't really have a lot of memory with him. But he wasn't really with you. Oh, he has no hard. idea what I've gone to. We have so much in common, VJ, it's not even funny. During dinner, VJ and Angela start complaining about their families, who died, who didn't die, what happened, what didn't happen. But my biological really dad just said he didn't want a child and left. Suddenly, everyone start having a race for who deserved the money most. You fools, I deserve the money most. I love this business. I love this business. Oh my God. I love this business. I love it. When you look at the runway right, and you're you there, it. there's all these lights. You love that you're beautiful. No, I'm not beautiful. I have 27 scars and I'm crazy and I just love life. And Modeling for me as well as music was always about like waking up in the morning and saying there's nothing I'd rather be doing with my life right now. So what is your dream? My dream is modeling, modeling and music. To be a successful model and to be a singer. Yeah, that's, that's my dream. Another love that I have that I didn't really talk about in the competition because I didn't want it to inhibit me is music. Music is one of my first loves. So who do you guys think is going to win this? I'd like to think I would win it. I know I will. And what about you? What are you going to say, Andre? I think she'll win. You think Angela won? Huh? I didn't mean that. <laughs> I was just playing, you know, war games. Angela, she's never going to win against me when it comes to fashion. Tomorrow boils down to who is the best in front of the camera and who's the worst. And I hate to break it to you, but the worst might be going home. I'm going to kill it. I'm going to be one of the finalists. Someone else is going home. It's not me. This is really about you guys getting great pictures how and how you work with a photographer and the team. I've had clothes flown in from all over the world for this. And then you each get to do a double shot with... With another model. Did you read my and sure as shit, like five models that we've never met in our lives walk through the door, and all of us, <laughs> what? Yeah. Jane? Nice take. Jane, Angela. VJ. Nice. VJ and Angela, my advice to you is you better bring your A game. <laughs> because I'm gonna smoke you tomorrow. We find out that this is our final modeling competition. It's a really big photo shoot. How's it going? Angela, Adam, nice to meet you. Adam, yeah. Yeah. Nice to meet you. All of a sudden, five other models walk into the room. Uh, this is about you figuring out who you have the most chemistry with tonight so that you can work the camera with tomorrow in your double shot. In this challenge, our models get to pick a professional model to work with them in their photo shoot. But once they pick that model, the other competitors can't use that model. Can I ask you one of your best piece of advice for me? You All just need to us. be comfortable. Stop trying to be a model and just be yourself. What time do we start? We're going to start bright and early, but that you know shouldn't stop you from having fun. Cheers. Cheers. Like, bring in the have models. fun. Yeah. Have fun Bye. tonight. Bye, Bye you guys. I was like, ooh, hello, ladies. <laughs> Right off the bat, when the models walked through the door, I was tractor beamed towards Heather. Very strong jaw, you know, big brown eyes. And I, I'm really looking forward to working with her. I work in New York and I work in Europe. I've never worked in LA in my age. It's so more I, of a commercial market. I've done good campaigns, I've done covers, and I've done all this stuff, so I just want to, but I've never been to LA. And, you seem yeah. like you have a lot of experience coming in. Do you think you have more experience than most of the other yeah, oh contestants yeah. here? Oh yeah, oh yeah, 
By far. By far. I won the I won, like the, the, I won the runway challenge recently. Can we see a runway look? <laughs> yeah, let's see. Let's see. Oh, it. Yeah. Let's see it. They were like, we could give you pointers. How's your walk? How's your walk? And I was like, serious? Oh! That walk, like this. I am a model, people. Me and my girl Lauren and you, we're gonna kill it. Jane and Lauren already want to shoot with me, they already like me, and that's exciting. And if everything goes well, then I'm planning on working with them tomorrow. You, you, can't, you can't try to be some picture you saw. You, you have to be yourself. Right. I decided that I was going to use the guys is because I figured the guys in the house were probably going to use the girls. I really wanted to be the focal point of the photo. No, you guys, you leaving? I'm going to get tomorrow. I'm going to in a few hours. <laughs> oh, we will. Tomorrow? Hey, let me show you guys the way out of my house. I had a great time, and I think we're all really anxious to shoot together tomorrow. I'm just ready to prove that I am America's most smartest model. final photo shoot so my goal today is to take everything that Mary Alice has taught me and apply it to this photo shoot to do a fantastic job hi Andre good morning are you ready for your photo shoot it doesn't look like it this is Roxanne Lowett oh, Roxanne. suddenly there's a million people coming into the house and waking me up. Oh, Van Jameson is in the shower. Should we go take a look? VJ! Oh, wow. Rinse off, throw on a towel, boom, walk outside. So today's photo shoot is basically, we're gonna keep it rock and roll. I'm excited that the premise of the shoot today is based on music because I love music, so I think I'll be able to be really natural with this. You have to be smart enough to work well with world-renowned Roxanne Lowick. Shoots for Italian Vogue, British Vogue, American Vogue, pretty much every Vogue on the planet. And do you remember our friend Luke? Incredible stylist. Luke does a lot for me with Spin Magazine. He's got a lot of our covers, and he's currently styling Marilyn Manson. And of course, there's our models who are back. The models look like hell. They look like they haven't even slept. <laughs> You know, to double up with one of the models, who you pick to be in that picture with you is very important. This is not an ordinary edge challenge. It's really important for you guys to understand that two of you will survive and one of you will not be going home to the mansion tonight. You ready to rock oh, this out, Andre? I'm so excited. This photo shoot is exactly what I've been waiting for. World-renowned photographer, great styling, plenty of clothes, no time limit, and on top of that, an unbelievable art director. Mary Alice. Unreal. We got all nine yards today. I mean, we got people who flew in from New York. We've got wardrobe. We've got hair, makeup, top dogs in the industry, and they're going to just do us up. I mean, we are about to look like some superstars. So, Andre, what's happening? Who's, who have you made your connection with? But, uh... Everyone. Good. But specifically, I'm going to have two girls around me. Who are you going to? Lauren and see. Jane. Mm -hmm. I have decided to shoot the two girls because it is rock and roll. They dig me, and it's going to look a lot better. Greg, Adam, could you come here for a sec, please? I decided that I was going to use the guys. I felt it would be easier to focus the attention on me if I was framed by two guys rather than girls who ultimately may have been able to steal a spotlight. So I've decided that for my group picture, I'm going to use you two, okay. and I am completely the center of attention. I want to command all the attention. So you need the shots I, I just to want to be out. very, like, very in control, very in charge. Okay. Uh, basically, if you guys don't do what I want, when I want, yeah. you're expendable. I can replace you easily. Yeah. I say jump, you guys say how high. Basically, on this shoot, the guys, they're working for me to make me look good, not the other way around. So, think about that. VJ, pick two girls you want in a picture with you. Andre is my number one competition. He is my opponent. 
he and I are so focused on the other person that I want him to fuck up and he wants me to fuck up. Uh, uh, Heather and uh, Lauren. Heather and Lauren. So I'm telling her I'm about to shoot with two girls. And what happens five minutes from that point? VJ picks two girls. What the hell is going on? Yes, what's happening, Andre? Is VJ shooting with my girls? I don't know, baby. Maybe he heard, overheard you telling me what your uh, the plan was. But uh, he asked to shoot with him, and so I said yes. I needed two girls for what I had in mind. And now I can't use these two girls because there's only three girls. So I have to use one girl. You're smart. You can deal with this. I am so pissed. I cannot use the models that he picked. So the only one that I have left is Jane. But I know I'm a great model, and I'm going to kill her. Do it to me. Give me the energy. Okay, hold it, hold it, hold it. Oh, nice. That's good. That's lovely. One more, one more, one more, one more. This one. Yeah, that's good. That's You're it. just gorgeous. Let him go crazy. Jan and I, great chemistry, great connection. Good, good. That's good, that's good. $100,000 is riding on this photo shoot. So I plan on kicking some serious rock and roll ass. Andre, time's Andre, up. Are you cool with that? We're done. I'm yeah, bring yeah. Bring DJ to get him comfortable. Absolutely. Video. This fucking prick. Dude, do you see this shit? I'm watching VJ copying my every single move and my plan with the two girls. Does he kiss? Does he he can't, can't, he can't, can't copy his every fucking That's shoe that I, every pose that he I did, do he's do doing. I'm in my first part of the photo shoot and I'm getting this Soviet death glare. Can't change the fact that I look good in my photos. What is he doing? So wait, this is your moment of what? Yeah. Glory. Okay, it's not that glorious. Turns out that Mary Alice hates it. This is like bad. This is not good. VJ is so disgusting. He doesn't know what to do. And I'm just enjoying it. The best revenge is success. And I'm gonna show him. Okay, so let it let it go. Let's go for your next idea. Yeah, let's go for your next idea. So wait, this is your moment of what? Something is yeah. glory. Okay, it's not that glorious. This is like bad. This is not good. Okay. Mary Alice hates it. Okay, you had a good idea, VJ, and I think you should go with your idea. Yeah. <laughs> exactly, that's what you want. Next thing you know, I'm in the pool, girls in the pool, throwing Lauren in the pool. I started just loving it. Ah, yay! Yes, this is exactly it. And then Mary Alice was like, yes, that's what I'm talking about. Good. Beautiful. Okay, time's up. Good job. Oh, it's a gold, golden goddess, baby. Don't overthink this photo shoot, Angela. Be natural. Have fun. You've got two hot guys on either side. Okay, guys. Yeah, no, I'm good. I like that. I like that. Charm me. Charm the camera. This shoot is really fun for me because I do really sing. Why don't we take up the tempo just a little bit? Okay. Yeah. Angela, okay. this isn't really a gig. You ha I know you want to get the gotta be going. beautiful. To you me. gotta be beautiful. Don't you're being too posy. I don't really need to take advice. I know what I'm doing. I am very smart. I'm very intelligent. Okay, time's Perfect. up. Time is up. Perfect. Angela, like she's like trying to just boss everybody around. Like tell them I want to do everything this way and that way. Fuck that bitch. Why are you a fucking model? Yeah. She's been doing this like the whole competition, yeah, just like yeah. trying to boss everybody around. I feel really confident that I am able to change it up and do a lot of different poses throughout the day. Woo! Look at you, girl. To make this photo shoot work to my advantage, I decided to go inside and do something that comes out very naturally. And I go around, but Angela is starting to sing and she has an unbelievable voice, but I'm really starting to think that she enjoys that more than modeling. And if that's the case, then that's what she needs to be doing. I couldn't ask for anything better at this time. It's great that you're singing I Love It, right, Roxanne? But oh, beautiful. Do not forget that you are a model. I'm having a sense that I'm not getting as good of photos as I could, and I'm starting to feel a little bit discouraged about it. Angela, you've had your body to the side like this your entire shoot, so move around. Should I po like stop moving? I'm not telling you what you should do, honey. Mary Alice was getting on me so much about being posy. Okay, time's Perfect. up. 
Good job. So I'm a little worried if I came off natural enough and whether or not I really got some good shots. Let's do this. Next setup, we're finally shooting indoors. My idea is to show versatility. So I'm planning on being more mellow, more laid back, more fun, and chill and relaxed. Shoot it! Two, one. <laughs> Andre's full of love today. Single photos, double photos, group photos. It's a little hectic, but it's exciting. That's the rock and roll. You look like a rock band. I feel like a rock star. Okay, Angela. I think my favorite part of modeling is just to get to dress up in all these fabulous, expensive clothes and just look great just for that moment. I want Angela to do so well today so I could get rid of this prick. You guys, that is a wrap. Um, great job. You all worked so hard. I really like to say thank you to Roxanne Lowett and Luke's story. Mary Alice calls it. It's a wrap. And right on. I think everybody felt good about their performances. I know I felt great. Uh, it was an unbelievable experience. Hey, guys. Thanks for the phone. Bye. So hot, dude. I mean, like that. Oh. It's cold, but... No, it feels so good. Photo shoot's done, and it's so hot outside. There's nothing better to do in Palm Springs but jump in the pool. How do you think you did on the shoot today? <laughs> Aside from copying Andre, meaning. Oh, please. One, I would never copy someone I don't like, so did I copy Blow that? me, bro. Oh, yeah. You fucking copied every photo shoot, yeah. every single picture. Of course, Andre just wants to make a bad day out of a beautiful one, so he starts ridiculing me of being a cheater, taking the model, stealing poses. It's like, does it ever stop? That's all I want. Does it ever stop? Again, you, you, you resort back to the same fucking things like a, a two-year-old would do. Andre's upset because he thinks you copied him, did you? Absolutely not. Never have I copied him What do you think, fucking, Angela? In this whole fucking competition. Angela, what do you honestly, think? Honestly, 100% honestly, I thought some of his poses did look similar to some of yours. I really think VJ might be a little bit of a pathological liar himself. I think he really sees ideas and he really convinces himself that he came up with those ideas. It's, it's there. Uh, this being a competition, Angela, we wake up every day in this competition with $100,000 at stake. I know there's $100,000 at risk, so I do what I have to do. I, mean, I should start charging you, bro, because you know what? This is ridiculous. You should start walking the fuck out that way. because Those are Russian ideas, not American. Because you're done, bro. Asshole. You are fucking done. Asshole. You are done. You that way. VJ is touching my face with his fucking hand, and I want to kill him right now. Hey, just go. Well, just go. Argue, go that way. Room, just go. But I am not going home because I hit this bastard. I'm not going to stoop down to his level. Honestly, I think I could beat either one of you. I'm out. Hey, but you know what? My clone will be right there. Suck a fuck, you piece of shit. We're getting into the elimination mode. into elimination. I am really anxious to see all of our photos. This photo shoot was a lot harder than I thought it would be, but I was able to pull it off. It's so, so, so sad. I'm competing against these people. I almost feel bad. I don't know what the hell they're doing here. They're not models, dude. Come on. Give me the fucking trophy and give me the money and let me go to New York, because I'm busy. First of all, I want to I want to thank you because um, spending the last 24 hours with you has been great. Today you all worked very hard, but as I said, one of you will be going home tonight. It was a hard decision, but actually a, a pretty obvious decision for me. Mary Alice scared me right away. She said the choice for me was very obvious, and I was like, "Fuck!" Did my inexperience show through to where it's me? Am I done? Is this the end of my road? Okay, so let's go right into Andre's pictures. Andre, this was one of your best doubles. You and Jane had great chemistry. Why did you pick Jane? I wanted Jane. So but you were going to use two other models, but then VJ grabbed them? Well, VJ wanted to have his, uh, yeah, everyone knows that. But um, I rolled the punches, I adapted quick, and uh, I, I did great. You really understand how to move your body 
in a picture and how graphic the way you held the guitar almost in every shot. I think that Andre's photos are excellent. He just looks so good in his photos. He can just capture that moment. Andre's next shot, you got a moment. And that's what makes this picture great, is it just feels kind of real. You're really good at posing. You bang this out within three shots, and that was the picture that I liked. That was you, and I love that, okay? You know, I really have to say there were so many that were good. You really used your smarts in this photo shoot to think about what other kind of character you could give us in front of the camera. Every different picture, there's a different angle, a different personality. You worked hard. Roxanne loved working with you. Um, hair and makeup liked working with you. Andre did great. That fucker's staying. Damn it. You did an incredible job, Andre, so. Thank you, man. I'm, so, I'm sorry. Thank you, Mary Alice. Good, yeah, good. Mary Alice. I said, babe. My photos look simply what I expected them to look like. Professional, natural, just me. And they loved every single one of them. Okay, so Angela, look at that body. You used your smarts to pick two of the better models. Great energy, great look, great pick of the models, but you kind of stayed in the same stance and you freeze up. You really do freeze up, and I don't know if it's the lack of experience, but you were giving me the exact same thing in almost every picture, okay? You know, you did not change your body in this picture. You sang, and what was so interesting is that we discovered you have an incredible voice. Thank you. I mean, all of us were blown away. Angela, she has an unbelievable voice, but I believe that she is more of a singer than she is a model. So, good job. Thank you. Um, let's go to VJ. We wanted to give you the opportunity to take control. When a model does something naturally and has a great idea, it's always worked into the photo shoot. But all of a sudden, you went into this kind of like, oh, and you had the models at your feet. And that was just, I was sitting there going, oh, no. Mary Alice got to the chase. And I was like, fuck, dude, this is probably going to be really bad. Your first 10 shots were Zoolander. Right. I mean, I was right. sitting there going, oh, okay. no, oh, no, oh, no. Beautiful VJ with his chest. That, that's boring in pictures. I'm so embarrassed for VJ right now. He is so cheesy. He has no idea what he's doing in front of the camera, what he should do in front of the camera. So you were really weak at the beginning. Right. You know, your inexperience, um, the ideas of what you think modeling should be, um, it was really hard to pick a photograph that I liked. I mean, I was just like, each pic, you know, out there, I was even like, oh, no. Bro, it doesn't matter what you do. Can't you see? You are not me. Now, this was a bit similar to Andre's shot. What happened? Tell me about this. I love it. Oh. VJ. So you were really weak at the beginning. You know, your inexperience, the ideas of what you think modeling should be. For the first time, I actually feel that I might be uh, going home. As the shoot went on, you got stronger. You know, sometimes you would get it wrong, but you didn't let, you didn't let it make you nervous or didn't let it stop you and we had fun freeze up. You just kept going and trying things and playing. And that's key when you're learning about this industry yeah. and about how to work in front of the camera. And this was just, you know, you're happy, you look great. You, at this point, had found your stride and felt, felt really confident. You, you were trying out. a lot of things. Sometimes they worked, sometimes they didn't. But you just kept going. Good job. Big sigh of relief. I thought I did horrible. Today, you all worked very hard. But, as I said, one of you will be going home tonight. VJ, peace, bro. Sometimes the most beautiful people are not the most successful models. So I'm just gonna cut right to the chase. I'm so sorry. Yeah. Angela, you today were not model enough. Okay. You were not the most comfortable in front of the camera. You know what, Angela? You are so smart and you are so beautiful. You have been given so many gifts, Angela. You really have. you always be able to make money as a model because you are that gorgeous. And I'm not so sure you have that natural gift as a model in front of the camera. And I want to thank you so much. Well, thank you. For all of your hard work. With Angela getting eliminated, well, she has a future in music. I'll say that's for sure. I'm sorry, sorry. I'm sorry too. I wanted it more than they did.
Nobody will ever be able to convince me otherwise. Andre, congratulations. You won the photo shoot. Having something that you know you want so much and know you deserve so much taken away that quickly and that easily. It's just, it's hard. Congratulations, VJ and Andre. Today, you were both smart enough and you were both model enough. Angela goes down and I have one more to go. I'm coming for you, buddy. You are headed back to the mansion where Ben will be preparing your final challenge. I'm not worried about this, Elvia. I have this feeling inside of me that says it is my time. It is my time and that's why I'm still here. So we'll see you later. Congratulations. We're end up killing each other before the show is over. I have to stay for one more day with this animal. Yeah, get back to the mansion. And boy, I'm, I'm exhausted. I'm just beat from the heat. Yeah, I'm ready to get a good night's sleep. Because tomorrow, we don't know what's gonna happen. It is so, so surreal getting back to an empty mansion. And I have to rearrange my fallen comrades. And on top of that, I have to add to my list Angela. The last person to go is VJ. And there's no ifs and buts now. He's going down. We started out 16. 16. Now we're down to the final two. It's surreal, you know? Boy, $100,000. Like it's there. It's so close. Opposites. <laughs> the good and the evil. Wow, dude. This is the finale. This is my last stand. As a Soviet, as a model, I'm so, so excited. Good morning, VJ. Good morning, Andre. How are you, gentlemen? It's just Andre and I in the house. I'm so ready, though, for whatever it is they have in store for us. Bring it on. Welcome to your last challenge, the last obstacle between one of you and the grand prize of $100,000. There's only one person who can really tell us who is America's most smartest model, and that person is you. That's right, your last challenge is to create a five-minute computer-based multimedia presentation about why you think you are America's most smartest model. Oh my God, so you thought the Jaguar thing was drama? I'm a little nervous, work with me. It is not a car, it is a vehicle. Oh God, oh crap, I'm in trouble. You've got to make clear points and give us visual proof that supports your arguments. Fuck yeah! <laughs> so stoked. There is no way this guy is going to beat me. Not on a presentation. And here to help you design and conquer are Kathy and Sally Dew of Tommy Dew Design. Be creative. What you include and how you choose to present it is completely up to you and your imagination. You can use anything you want. Your baby pictures, the video footage from the show, to uh, stock stills from Corbis, really anything at all that demonstrates why you are a smarter model than your opponent. Something easy for this asshole. How convenient. VJ, talk about VJ. That's just beautiful. Andre, you won the Edge Challenge. To help you out, we are going to give you the shiny new Sony Ericsson Z750 mobile phone. It's a great looking device, built in camera. You can do anything with this. You can browse the internet, you can make calls to your friends if you have any. It's a great phone. It is smart on the inside and sexy on the outside, very much like moi. The model who makes the best presentation will win. Get ready for it the title of America's Most Smartest Model, and win the Extreme Style by VO5 grand prize of $100,000. May the most smartest model win. Ladies, they're all yours. Good luck. Good luck. Good luck, man. Good luck.
I'm Sally. Nice to meet you. Let's get going. We get our PowerPoint presenters, and I go straight to Kathy. The whole point with the presentation is, you know, we want to tell a story. We have five minutes to tell a story. With the end conclusion being, no question about it, you are America's most smartest model. Oh, God. Poor Kathy's trying to keep me focused, and uh, I can't seem to pull myself together. What differentiates you two? I couldn't believe, honestly, till this day, I can't believe I'm, I'm competing with... He's copying every uh, every every pose that I'm doing. Even the judges said, this looks like Andre. This I'm so worked up. My head is just all over the place. Jim Sneaking, right. cheating, right. lying. My thoughts, and it's just, I, I'm so lost. And I think you want to leave him not with you dissing somebody else. That's just my opinion. Okay, me, I, I could be wrong, and you what know. What is dissing me? This doesn't look good at all. All right, well, let's start working on flow. Get teamed up with my PowerPoint specialist, Sally, and she and I just get to work right away. Even if he has, you know, more credentials or more modeling experience, if I prove to them that I am a better presenter, that's what they'll look at. Right. I want to go up there and just... And just be smooth. Yeah. Showing that I am a step ahead of everybody else. Yeah, if I were a dog, it'd be a you'd be a golden retriever, loyal, strong, reliable, and your opponent's more like a pit bull. You never know when they're going to snap. Snap. Right. It was my small stroke of genius of giving Andre the personality of a dog, of a vicious dog, of putting a cute picture of a smiley, happy Labrador next to this disgusting photo of a Rottweiler with foam and fangs, saying, just never know when they're going to snap. Genius. Why VJ is not... The, no. America's but I need to look. I need to look on the smartest model. He is a liar. He's a cheater. He sabotages his teammate. He does not have the right measurements, nor the height. Um, I'm going crazy. Try to come up with something brilliant, and that is just nerve-wracking to me because I could barely speak proper English. Well, you were starting to talk a little bit about lessons learned be the best without really talk about it as much. So without having to brag, you mean? Or... It's better to, to win through action than to speak of it. Show me, don't and, you? Right, look like a fool, even though you know what you're talking about. I feel like I'm dreaming and I'm, it's a nightmare and I can't wake up. Oh, that's a thing we should talk about. You are gonna be the one in charge of Slides. advancing the slide. Do you want to get back to this? I feel like, like my head is just exploding. I just got to come up with something better than just presenting myself. You got five minutes though, you know. What do you want to leave them with? Oh my God. Suddenly, my head begins to clear and this amazing idea comes into my mind. It is a Sony Ericsson mobile phone. You can make calls to your friends. Friend, friend, calls, calls to your, your friends, friends, do you have any? VJ, you're about to have the shuck of your lifetime. Yo, it's Andre. Bro, I never had a chance to talk to you. You have a great body, yes, but you're too big. Jesse, 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 you knew you were gonna have to lose a little weight. Andre, you need to calm the fuck down. You're a model, you know, loosen up. Smile a little more. No, I'm just fucking kidding with you, bro. Stay the way you are. Thank you, guys. Thank you. I won't disappoint you. If I win this, I want everyone to know I'm gonna give $5,000 to each one of you. Just so you know what Russia is all about. 